murder which is sweeping the eastern third of the nation is being committed by creatures who feast upon the flesh of their victims. First eyewitness accounts of this grisly development came from people who were understandably frightened and almost incoherent. Officials and newsmen at first discounted those eyewitness descriptions as being beyond belief. However, the reports persisted. The medical examinations of some of the victims bore out the fact that they had been partially devoured. I think we have some late word of just arriving, and I'll interrupt to bring this to you. This is the latest disclosure in a report from National Civil Defense Headquarters in Washington. It has been established that persons who have recently died have been returning to life and committing acts of murder. A widespread investigation of reports from funeral homes, morgues, and hospitals has concluded that the unburied dead are coming back to life and seeking human victims. It's hard for us here to believe what we're reporting to you, but it does seem to be a fact. When this emergency first began, radio and television was advising people to stay inside, behind locked doors for safety. Well, that situation has now changed. We're able to report a definite course of action for you. Civil defense machinery has been organized to provide rescue stations with food, shelter, medical treatment, and protection by armed National Guardsmen. Stay tuned to the broadcasting stations in your local area for this list of rescue stations. Well, hello there, few good men. It's spooky month, and that means spooky wargaming. And this is a zombie outbreak simulation for the Operation Flashpoint. Let's get the uh, technical stuff out of the way first. Uh, the version of Operation Flashpoint I'm using is the 2011 re-release under the name of uh, Arma Cold War Assault. And uh, you can get that on like Steam and GOG and it works straight out of the box. The only issues is uh, some insane mouse sensitivity that you have to tone down and the uh, game doesn't natively support uh, widescreen. And that brings us to an issue with the uh, mission itself. Uh, the mission is running uh, some sort of a color filter on it that makes it look like I have some sort of a wonky contrast or uh, brightness settings going on. But no, that, that's just a color filter and unfortunately I'm unable to run the game in widescreen because that uh, filter messes up. That doesn't mesh up with the uh, widescreen settings that you can you can do widescreen with the, some jiggery with the config files, but uh, yeah, so <laughs> we're doing this uh, just a teensy bit stretched. So le let's get to the mission itself. As the uh, briefing here says, uh, evacuate as many civilians as possible. Basically, on this island, there is a single platoon of uh, National Guardsmen. One squad mans the rescue center here, where we can uh, rearm, repair our vehicles, and where we also have to escort the civilians. Second squad runs those evacuation convoys, and they are run run by AI, and the first squad is run by me. And our mission is to go into these towns around the island, make contact with any survivors, survivors and then call in the uh, evacuation convoys. We can only run two evacuation convoys at a time, and we have to make contact with the civilians in these towns first before we can call them in. And of course, we also have to fight off uh, any zombies we might come again up against. 
So, the plan that I've come up with is that we have 10 members in our squad, two Humvees. I'll be uh, splitting the squad into two teams, Alpha and Bravo. I'll be going out uh, with Alpha and Bravo is... Uh, I'll give them orders remotely and Bravo squad will once we hit San Alto will swing over to the west and get these few towns three towns actually on, on this peninsula here kill any zombies and uh, I, I can order order the AI to actually call me in the uh, the evac convoys on, on these towns and uh, alpha team with me leading that will we won't be actually stopping in these towns and wait for the evac convoys to get, get to them because if, if we do that uh, the uh, zombies are gonna start killing people uh, swelling up their numbers and soon we are ju just gonna get overwhelmed really quickly. So what we do is we'll hit San Antlo, swing northeast to Vilm, go, go on this ring road to Vadora, from there to Porvo and into the um, northern section of the island and we only gonna stopping the towns long enough to kill the zombies that might be threatening the uh, survivors there then we'll move on and I I'll leave one guy when we hit Vilm on foot behind so he can make keep contact with the survivors calling one of the evac convoys and the rest of the alpha team is just gonna keep moving on with the Humvee and uh, well that single guy can move on to the next town mo over on foot and calling more evac convoys. Basically our job is to contain the zombie threat while the evacs are going on and uh, that is gonna take time. So let's uh, outfit our squad. I'm the only one who has NVGs and I'm fairly certain uh, hand grenades are gonna be a bit useless I mean the AI is kinda stingy about using them anyway so it's just better to bring bring two extra magazines sidearms for everyone also I think I'm gonna switch out M60 for this guy He's the guy who's gonna stay behind on foot when we reach Vilm, so uh, better to him <laughs> for him to have the uh, extra firepower. And yeah, if you guys played Arma Three, the uh, the the inventory system is a uh, doesn't really let you to carry that much stuff. All of this, any piece of equipment, magazine, takes at least one slot. Some take two. And uh, yeah, the maximum amount of magazines you can carry is just ten. Right. Yep, that's... It will be ready to go. All right, have to order the guys to mount up on hundreds here. Eight, nine, ten, get in cheap. Roger. I'm using the uh, Five, easier cadet. Difficulty. Six, waiting. 
because you, you, yeah, it just allows me to actually to use the flashlights or the rubber team get to Saint Renoir yeah like I said I'm using the easier carrot difficulty it allows me to use a uh, third person view while driving just make things a little easier I also can see where, where the guys on Bravo team are gonna be as an icons on the map. And yeah, just a heads up, there's gonna be a lot of driving in this, in this mission. We'll do a quick, quick stop at San Alto, we'll call it the evac convoy there immediately, since it's just so close by. Alright, we have civvies around, any zombies? Oh, yeah, there's a dead body. We can actually, the zombies are gonna, after they've died, it's gonna take two minutes for them to get back into life. But we can stop that and from them becoming a threat using the hide body action. That basically causes them to sink into the ground, simulating the fact that we've somehow dead with, with the body, burned it or something. Oh! That's a zombie. You can tell them they are zombies because uh, they're all bloody, bloody and whatnot. And yeah, some of these civilians here, I don't run away now, may have weapons, so they are not completely defenseless. And now I have to. There's a clear area. There. Now an evac convoy of a couple of more Humvees will... Yeah, there it shows on the map. More Humvees on the way, coming to pick up them up from there. So basically what I did there was approach these civilians, use an action menu option to start the evacuation, then clicked on the map where I want the, the people to be picked up from. The civilians will move into that area and as you can see and the evacuation convoy will also move there. You should pick up a, a, a clearing or something if you select nearby woods or a building the uh, Evac Humvees might get stuck. Stuck on something and uh, well, uh, you're now down uh, an Evac convoy. Nothing to be done about that. Alright, probably the team is almost at Saint Renoir. I'm just gonna have them do the same thing that we did in San Alto. Kill any zombies, order them to hide the bodies, and calling an evac convoy, then moving to the uh, immediately to the next town. I'm not gonna let, leave them there to provide cover or anything in here. Since the evac convoy should be there rather quickly. Arriving at Alright. 
be commanding the AI now. Silly guys. those guys into the town itself. Check, check the AI's action menu. No options for... Alright, good. Now the evac convoy is heading back to the rescue center. Robot team's action menu. Not seeing any hide bodies options yet, so... I haven't reported anything also, so... Ah, uh, they have spotted some... CVs, so... Order them to get close enough, so they can uh, make contact. This is a bit of a hassle. Oh good, no bodies, so apparently there's no no zombies. Evacuate. They have the hide body option now, so there is a zombie. But probably the survivors took it out temporarily. We'll have to. No more bodies, so I think we're clear to send the Bravo team to the next town. No, let's leave the uh, their LMG guy there for cover, just in case. some survivors and a downed zombie. Oh man, uh, these guys are packing. Oftentimes there's just Six, ready. just a single single civilian who has a as a weapon. Right. Oh damn. Okay, now we have access to uh, Delta Green again. We have made contact with group of survivors. Transmitting coordinates for you right now. Right, and we are leaving Miss Trooper number five. Five, disembark. Run here. Five, ready. to get the uh, Bravo team to move on to Meridian. Six, move to Delta, Alpha, seven, nine. Roger. Right to order. Five, halt. Roger. Stay there. Get to Vadora and deal with any zombies that might be there. Yeah, just let's go off road with the cross country here. 
to break into the town. Oh wow, there. Check out that. A lot of zombies. these bodies and uh, I don't think there's any survivors here. Oh, fuck! Okay, the uh, MG is reloading. Oh damn, that's a lot of zombies. Help? Now we have the... Deal with these bodies real quick. Oh man, they just keep coming. Order I kill these guys so uh, some of them might revive. Survivors loaded. And yeah, in case you're wondering, we are not safe. Oh, he revived. So we are not gonna be safe. Inside the Humvee, the zombies will damage. Damage the vehicle Man, this history. and basically eventually we'll we'll just have to dismount it. Otherwise, it's it's gonna blow up in a, with with us inside. So yeah, we can't just uh, s sit in the Humvee. I mean, we we can just I guess we could drive over these guys, but it's gonna be difficult to. Hordes of this size. Oh fuck! Oh. And when it comes to like ammunition situation, uh, there is once a survivor is killed and they revive as a zombie. they lose any weapon that they might have. So these zombies are not gonna have any weapons or ammo for us to scrounge. Okay, this guy can start moving towards the Bravo team. They almost the target. I'm not really confident there's gonna be anyone to save in here. Yeah, there's a blood spatter there. Survivors in, in this part of the uh, town are generally here. Yep. And they're probably dead in here as well. Yep. They will be by the fountain. Basically these two two towns. 
got fully zombified and uh, that that's why there were so many of them. Number five can just start jogging it to Orvo. Roger. Will me saved. Six waiting. Come on. Six, don't you tell Find the survivors. Seven, uh, Six waiting. This doesn't look good. Looks like Meridian. Oh, Mary Dan was zombified and Le Brigia doesn't look doesn't look promising for those guys. Like we've been uh, dealt, dealt a pretty bad Waiting. hand this time. Towns close to us have already been hit hard by the zombies. And uh, well, uh, Generally, when I did, did like a couple test runs, that the mission runs fine. And yeah. Oh, there goes the evac on board. Yeah, the huge zombie blob formed here in the northern bank of the map. And uh, these places were generally safe for quite a while. But yeah. Oh, uh, yeah. They're they're seeing zombies over there now. Watch what in here. Oh, it looks like survivors. Who, 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 who. Any dead around? Oh, let's call an evac for these people. I'm not seeing any zombies ready. here. I've got him. So let's uh, order Bravo team to uh, this mode and deal with these. Those dead bodies. Nine, ready. Ten, waiting. I've got him. Six, ready. Roger. 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 And yeah, whether or not the rescue center can be overwhelmed. Nine, ready. I, I. Ten, ready. I don't know. Roger. 
the, I, I didn't really show the area because, you know, we're we run out. On a timer here? But the, uh, there's like a couple of M2 machine gun positions covering them, and of course the entire of the third squad. So, should be secure for quite a while. Right, more survivors. Okay, this this is looking a bit better. No dead bodies around town here. Good, 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 good. You guys are at least safe a little bit. Oh god, this flashlight. Looks awful. Just sticking to my uh, NVGs. Six, Charlie, Charlie, seven, nine, man, fifty. Okay. Six, Charlie, Charlie, seven, nine, man, fifty. Six, Elder Green is Charlie, almost Delta, seven, available. Nine, oh enemy, shit, I totally forgot Bravo to there. Six, Charlie, Delta, seven, nine, man, Engaging 50. the zombies now. I've got him. Six. They earlier killed those people, but they have uh, revived now. Oh, that's a lot of zombies. Oh, they got one of my guys. We can almost call in Delta Green now. Nine, Come on. Roger. Have to keep ordering Roger. these. Alright. Finally. I could have had one of my AIs in Alpha Team drive this Humvee for me, but I don't really trust the AI driving. That guys, ditch my Beretta in the Humvee. Nine o'clock, man, fifteen. And they ah, oh, damn it, too late, too late. He had a Smith and Wesson Wesson revolver. I would have tried to take it. Little bit of extra ammo would have been really helpful in here. Roger. Roger. Nine ready. Is this really everyone in this town? Roger. Ten ready. Five, 
Five, go, Bravo, six, three, enemy, man, uh -oh. 100. Nine, Charlie, Charlie, Ooh. eight, zero. Portable is under attack. Fuck. I got it. Man, is he back? Nine, is almost there and Mr. Number it. Five is dealing nine, with it. Charlie, Charlie, seven, nine, enemy, man, 50. Oh man, yeah, I'm just nine, getting Bravo Charlie, team out of there. Seven, Five, go, Bravo, six, three, man. Nine, ten, 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 Damn. 11 o'clock. Enemy. Man. 50. Man is history. Man is history. Five. Go. Bravo. Six, yeah. Three, this is enemy, how uh, <laughs> Iron Sights look in Operation Five, Flashpoint. Go, bravo. <laughs> Six. Three. Enemy. Man. 50. Man is history. It's just I a silhouette la laid over your screen. Roger. Bravo team is getting Nine messed is up. Down. Ten o'clock, man. One hundred. I've got him. Didn't you mean to do that. Twelve o'clock, man. One hundred. Five. Go. Bravo. Six. Three. Man. Fifty. I've got it. Five. Go. Bravo. Six. Three. Man. Fifty. Two o'clock, man, fifty. Five, golf, bravo, six, three, man, fifty. Five, golf, alpha, six, four, man, one hundred. Five, golf, bravo, six, three, enemy, man, fifty. Oh, uh, yeah, seven, no, number Charlie, five is Charlie, getting overwhelmed seven, there. Nine, enemy, man, fifty. Remnants of Bravo, hopefully, out of there. Though, so, oh, the zombies are swarming the uh, hunting. It might be unusable. So it very well might be that. Uh, yeah, it's a, it's fucked. Sounds like a uh, man is history. Number five is dead Roger. also. Oh no, five is down. Eight. Things are not, not going uh, very well. Uh, well, we'll. Two, three, four, get in cheap. Roger. Seven, report status. Hopefully the survivors at the tree glove are still okay. Oh, fuck! Yeah, screw those guys. Just... Check in turn here. Though I doubt there's anyone left here. Oh no, there is actually. We might have to, you know, defend this place. And, uh. uh 
Humvee doesn't have a... That many rounds left. One full belt and one with the 60 rounds left. Wait, check Three, position Don't here in case the zombies follow us. On the way. I'll need to get an evac when we're going. Oh, except ah, uh, both are out I on the field. And yeah, they are indeed following us. We'll have to. There's still seven magazines left. Oh, I didn't remember to pick my Beretta from the Humvee. It's freaking Hansel and Gretel breadcrumb trail of zombies. They'll actually have to send one guy meet with the CVs so we can call in the evac convoy as soon as possible while I'll, I'll deal with this. Try to stay, stem the tide here. Oh man, they just keep coming. I really sucks that I forgot my Beretta in the glove compartment of that uh, Humvee. Oh, uh. About that Beretta, one little weird thing. In this Operation Flashpoint, the uh, Beretta for some reason has a magazine size of only 10 rounds. Oh, god damn it. Yeah, that happens when the uh, zombies actually attack you. Basically, you take a little bit of damage. And uh, this animation plays out where you your guy strikes the zombie down it's automatic there's no way to stop stop that animation you just have to wait for it to play out and if you get swamped by zombies there's a good chance that they can kind of stun lock you via that uh, animation all right, wow. All right, let's just run back to town now. Things got a bit hectic there. Five full magazines, one partial. Check out the other guys. Uh, six mags. Six. Guy, guy up on the MG on the Humvee, he still has full 10 rounds, or 10 magazines.
do yourself out on the ammo for this thing either. Right now I'm gonna take my pistol. Yeah, like I was saying before, the zombie surprised me. Uh, for some reason, the Beretta only has 10 round magazines instead of the, what, uh, 15, 16 ish of, of the real life. All right. Oh. Number eight from Bravo team is still bravely moving on on foot. What's his name? Private Chris Marie. All right. Damn, yeah. Oh, LMG guy got overwhelmed. At Porvo and Oh I just noticed Delta Green is stuck stuck there and I'm hearing gunfire there might be zombies there. Let's go help them out. Yeah, those we dealt the huge pack of zombies. The, these civvies have to fend for themselves. There was at least one guy with a gun, so come on, run faster. Yeah, I may have made a Big mistake leaving those zombies behind us since the uh, evac convoy may have been attacked by them now. Damn it. deal with the body so he, he doesn't come back to haunt us I'm not hearing anymore just heard that one burst so uh, I'm not sure if that's a good thing or a bad thing Lights are still on there, and there's a dead body here. A lot of dead bodies. I think the uh, evacuation of this particular da town can be called a failure. Can hear an engine. Okay, hey, you guys. Um, are you just stuck here now? Since there's no survivors. Yeah, it must probably be this guy shooting. Oh, look at that. That is a lot of zomboids. We'll probably have to clear out the... Uh... Can I like order these? Okay, there, there's one, one person in there. Oh, never mind. Uh, 
Yeah, I have to figure out if there's a way to order those people to uh, get, get a move on. This is not good there, we have to get Fjord there. And uh, going into the water is a... Uh, bit risky in Flashpoint, since you can't actually swim in this game. If you... Okay, the other evac convoy I think is coming there now. If you go into water that's too deep, you just automatically start to take damage and drown. Oh yeah, great, great idea shooting them here now. I can't exactly see where the bodies went. Uh, please don't drive over me. Man is history. I've got it. Man is history. Man is history. I've got it. Soldier is history. One injured. Oh, look. Here's a... Uh, oh, LMG guy. Rest in pieces. the north. Oh man, it sucks if that the... Uh... Oh, and we are on our no, last belt for the 240 on this Humvee. Yeah, if that second evac convoy is stuck there now. I don't know, are, are they like waiting on on this guy? Is that like there's plenty of CVs on board. What if I uh, nudge him a bit? No, he's just gonna stand there. I really wish there was some sort of a command, you know, script that command like like refit units. That that's basically if we are close to the rescue center, we can click on that and uh, we get resupplied and healed. I wish there was a similar one for just for the convoy to get, get back. I think mean, we, like, totally by accident hit this guy a little too hard. You know, j j just a bit of a love tap that, that's far more of a tap. Then, then, then the lava part. Oh, but then if the uh, AI thinks that I killed the, that guy on purpose, they might start shooting at me. Should I risk it? Yeah, okay, okay. 
Evac Delta Green seems to be stuck. At least uh, this can be complicated where. But okay. Oh well. Yeah, I mean, this, I'm fairly certain the last auto save, the uh, convoy was stuck, still. Oh, let, let, let's just try taking out, out this dude. Okay, hey, 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 hey. Let, let's hope that the AI doesn't kill me now. Oh no no it's survivors loaded for the Yeah, Delta Blue. No, Delta Green is, is stuck. Well I'm gonna take his ammo. Three disembark! Roger. Three waiting. Three take magazine from Soldier, nine o'clock. Roger. These guys can Four. take some ammo as well. Waste not all that. the body Let, let's see if there's anyone left to save here oh man bravo team L lmg dude he's almost at the uh, san alto just go buy food back back to the uh, rescue center We still have one evac convoy to do, so let, let's let's just keep going. I'm gonna just deep over the cross country here. Yarna. One, danger. Oh, those are bushes. Don't die. <laughs> there were zombies just standing out on the field there. This seems to be a, a ghost town. Now, let's do some deduction. The uh, zombies that hit Borvo, they came from uh, from the west, so I'm fairly certain this Bel Nuevo has been zombified and they came across the uh, this cliffside from there. So let, let's hit north. Though it's fairly probable that the zombies we engaged at Saint Bivouac came from these northern towns. But uh, let's check them anyway. Ooh, lightning. Yeah. 
yep. Looking pretty empty. Just a whole lot of rolling buildings, not even zombies around. Well, probably gonna cheat myself by saying that. Yeah. One more town up here. Almost, but halfway back to base. Yeah, I figured that's much. Too late. All right, well, we might as well check Bel Nuevo. Hope against hope, and all that. Ooh. Yeah, the wonderful vehicle yeah, physics of Flashpoint when uh, going off road. I wonder those two hordes, the one we engage and Saint 
between the road between Turnia and Saint Yoke and yeah uh, and the one at the fjord there I wonder if that that's like made up it's made up of, of all the people from these empty towns and we basically cleared out this part of the map I don't know he's just well, almost back at, back at base so he's pulling out his scene like I don't know the uh, machine gun emplacements and one nothing to worry about there Almost at the very last, very last town. It looks like uh, those CDs that were just this delivered back to the rescue center, uh, that's gonna be the last to look. There's a hospital on, on this time to check out, but uh, I mean, yeah. It's looking pretty bad. This is the area, and there's no one here. Yep, we've checked all of the times now. We lost half of our squad in an attempt to. Uh, Save the uh, people of the Sarugawa Island. Let's uh, hit the end end mission command and see how many uh, CVs we actually saved. I'm fortunate that the uh, this convoy got stuck. There was I don't know. We would have easily gotten like five more CVs. Rescued survivors, 51. Oh, all right. After a long search all over Sarugao Island, it seems like we found all of the survivors and evacuated more than 30. All right, all right. Well, 51. And if the uh, Delta Green convoy wouldn't have gotten stuck, probably would have been 55, 56. I don't know, let, let's just say that the uh, Delta Green convoy, they just came on, uh, uh, this apathy came on them, and they they just decided to sit down and wait for the sweet release of death. That That's the official story, what happened to them. Yeah, that's a whole lot of kills. Our ah, casualties. Five men. One from Alpha Team, four from Bravo. Well, that was the uh, zombie outbreak simulation for Operation Flashpoint. Blech. 
Hope you enjoyed. Ala link provide links to this mission on the uh, back on the forums wherever I uh, end up posting this, this video there and uh, if you wanna give it a try out for yourself uh, it comes packed with all, all of the necessary add-ons you need so uh, see you a few good men later and uh, stay spooky